Eisenhower looks to avenge last year's district semifinal loss as they battle Rochester for the district championship. In the first inning with a man on third, Joe Zantini hits a grounder, but would be safe on a bad throw, scoring John Fantauzo to put Ike up one to nothing. Bottom of the first with a runner on third, Marty O'Neill gets a base hit to score Drew Loftus to tie the game at one apiece. Ike gets things rolling in the second as Peyton Metavarsky, Brendan LaRue, and Joey Camerata hit three consecutive singles to load the bases. Then Jake Miller hits a soft ball to first base, but the first baseman can't make the tag, and LaRue scores to put the Eagles back in the lead. Ben Metz gets a base hit to right center field, scoring Camerata. And John Fantauzo, after the throw to home, gets away from the catcher. Then a dropped third strike to send Zantini to first base, but it's mishandled, which would score Jake Miller and Ben Metz. Ike goes up 6-1. but the pitcher Luke Castron would end the inning on this incredible diving catch. At the bottom of the second, Jake Lorenzo would add a run for Rochester after a wild pitch by Colin Sealing. To the fourth inning, with a runner on first, Metz hits a bomb to the outfield and Miller looks to score a run, but he's tagged out at home plate. Then Joe Zantini hits a sack fly with a great catch by the right fielder. And Ben Metz scores a run, making it 7-2 Eisenhower. Ike would add two more runs in the seventh for good measure as Andrew Gajewski and Jacob Devereaux both score coming in as pinch runners. Ben Metz makes the game-winning catch to give Eisenhower the 2018 district title. We caught up with head coach Steve Spisak to hear his thoughts. I thought the 23-man army that I brought here today uh, did a phenomenal job. Uh, the first game was the best baseball game I've seen all season. Uh, it was pretty much a perfectly played game by both teams. Uh, it was a fantastic game. Uh, I was just glad to be part of it. Uh, second game, uh, we kept the bats going. Uh, it was a full effort, uh, 23 different players all, all added uh, a lot to the team all year and, and that was the difference today. Um, what we've worked on all year, and it, it just came to fruition today. Uh, Colin Sealing is uh, a sophomore pitcher who is uh, blessed with a, a, a thunderbolt for a right arm and uh, he comes to work every day. Uh, the seniors love him, uh, he smiles and uh, everyone loves uh, having Colin Sealing on, on the team. We've proven this year that when we want to play baseball, uh, we can beat anyone at any time, and, and we just need to keep that mentality. Uh, I'm just proud of these guys, all 23 of them. Uh, they, 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 they've just been uh, willing to, to do what it takes uh, to win a district championship, uh, and I'm pretty sure uh, we're going to go give our best effort in the regionals next week. With this win, the Eagles advance to regionals, where they will face Brother Rice in the first round.